chillin' with Adam, huh? Yeah, I'm just chillin' with Adam, huh? I'm just chillin' with Adam, huh? Look, that's the host of Adam, huh? I'm just chillin' with Adam. <laughs> I mean, I obviously DM'd you because I wanted to clear things up, but then I watch in the stream and like you're loosely dropping things to imply that I was somewhat involved with what went oh, down. I never That's said the that. kind of vi the, the vibes I was getting. I apologize Ooh. for that. I apologize for yeah. that completely. Even when I talked to my manager, he said, yo, the reason I did this to Sam and he explained like some shit about running, yeah. I never once, and even when I said it here, when I explained that you and Hampton Brandon came, yeah. I, during this live stream, I said, I'm not saying it was their audience, but I'm saying it, it was like, it was a fan. It wasn't me, it was a fan. And that's what I was expecting. I yeah, never well, would put you down fan, like that. Yeah, not but someone, yeah. So, so I you wanna hear my series of events what went down? I have no then, idea, I, I haven't wanna, even heard yeah, it yet. I wanna, I wanna like try and tell you what went down because there was some like uh, kind of borderline uh, problematic behavior from some of your staff. Um, I don't know your relationship with uh, John Fitzpatrick. Or do you, do you, okay. is he your manager no. or do you work together at all or you help put on the yeah. event? Yeah, whatever. So him and Country, I both had some altercations with them at the event. So you know how it went down. I DM'd you, you said come by. I talked to your girl or your assistant. My or, girlfriend. Yeah, your girlfriend. And she came and gave me password, uh, the passwords to the Wi-Fi and she gave me bands and I went in. And I was streaming, streaming, streaming. And then uh, we got uh, called out. Uh, someone said there was a power cut, which obviously it turned out not to be a power cut. They mm -hmm. called us into another room and they said, look, there's been this bomb threat um, and it's, we think it's a prank. We're going to clear everyone out. Once that's done, we're going to pull people back in. Okay? Mm -hmm. I'm still streaming at the time. All of this is streamed. Uh, I go outside. Wi-Fi is kind of shit. So I go back, sit in the VIP. Oh, I, let me rewind. Mm. I'm side stage, right? Right at the <laughs> very so beginning. Honest. This is when Adam is on. This is when Adam's on stage. I, this voice comes up behind me and they're like, yo, you want a Wrigley's deal? And I turn around and it's fucking uh, John Fitzpatrick. And John Fitzpatrick used to be my manager back at Collective. Oh, shit. Yes. This goes deep. Yeah, so yeah, so this is kind of, yeah. So anyway, he, he says that to me and it's a snide remark because of all of the drama that happened back in the day. He dropped me as uh, from Collective and also, I had this Wrigley's deal that was for $70,000 for one video, and I lost that deal. So he comes up behind me and says, can I get you a Wrigley's deal? As a snide remark, like, fuck you, you got dropped, you lost everything, and you lost that money. And I'd said nothing to this guy. Uh -huh. um, and so I'm just, I'm just standing now, I'm like, right, whatever, I don't engage in it, because I you know, I know I'm better than that. And I, I, to be honest with you, I think he was a bit drunk, but I don't think that's an excuse for saying anything. I walk off and I'm explaining to my stream what's going on. I'm I don't believe he was drunk. I don't know, okay. okay. Uh, well, he's at the bar a lot, I, I don't know. Uh, it doesn't matter if he's drunk, sober, whatever. Let's not make this, uh, like, just tell it, but don't, without, like, because I, I, I work with him. I don't want to make him seem like a bad person, because I, re I respect how he works with Okay, me, okay, so. I'm just saying, in my opinion, I think he was drunk. Uh, don't take that for fact. Um, I walk off and I explain the, the story to my stream. Uh -huh. And he's kind of like li lingering in front and he's hearing the whole story. What the story I just told you about, how the drama and la la. Uh -huh. I, walk, I walk a bit further forward and then he comes back to me again for his second dick. And this time he says to me, you know why Wrigley's, you know why Wrigley's uh, actually didn't want to work with you? Wrigley's is a huge company. They have a stadium. Like everyone knows Wrigley's gum. Who are you? What's your name again? What's your name again? And he just looks at me and he just keeps saying over and over again, what's your name again? Is this on stream? What's, yeah, it's on stream, but the connection there was really bad. So I was going in and out of S. A lot of it's on stream and some of it isn't. So I have to pull up all the clips if you want to see them. I have to go through them and I'll compile them, whatever, mm -hmm. if you really want to see it. But I'm, I'm telling you the truth, right? What's your name again? What's your name again? And I'm like not playing into it. I'm just standing there, pointing the camera at him, letting him have a say. Because when people are idiots like that and just brainless haters it's much more uh, productive just to film them because the live stream sees them for who they are so I point the camera at him he's saying it over and over again and then uh, eventually he walks off and then that's when the bomb threat happened uh, we all get pulled outside the work the service is really bad now I walk back in a little bit I'm kind of like getting my Wi-Fi I'm standing around and this is when uh, Country walks up to me, so Country sees me inside, and he says, yo, you can't be here, which is a fair point. I think that's completely fair. I also heard, like, you were in an area that no one was allowed to be in. I was like, you know where the, oh, you, I don't know if you, did you check I out the venue before? I didn't get into yeah. my own So room. I was in the VIP area, and that's, everyone was being holded on this, like, outside section of the VIP area. I was in the VIP area where the food was, uh -huh. and there wasn't many people around, maybe one or two. 
Um, people using the restroom, la 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 la. So he comes up to me. He's pretty. He's coming in pretty hot, but I I'm, I completely agree with him. If he wants me to like move out of an area, I'll move out of an area. So. <laughs> Wait, Fusi throwing I mean, shade by looking at ISIS chat. No, I'm trying to read. I didn't read really the, really the no what jumper chat. I apologize. Yeah. So he comes up to me pretty hot, uh -huh. and he he starts kind of like he starts come. You know when someone says come with you and you start walking, but then they're like still like uh -huh. pushing. Who's this from? Uh, country. Oh, because that's my like. He'd literally he'd take a bullet for me. Okay, but so you weren't doing... there, and there was no one for him to take a bullet for. But and I was he, and I was already leaving. He was. I'm just telling you how I know my team. He was probably told. He's an aggressive person. He was probably told. Saying? Somebody probably told him. Yeah, yeah. No, like he'll he'll do. Somebody probably told him keep an eye out on this guy. And I know exactly who told him that. Anyway, so he starts pushing me. He starts pushing me. The moment I go around the corner, John Fitzpatrick standing right there. Okay, it makes sense why country's being so aggressive with me now. I keep walking towards the exit, and they're chucking me out the main e exit right now, where all the fans are waiting. Mm -hmm. So all the like VIPs or whatever you call them, influencers, were in a separate section. They've chucked me out into like where all the fans were, which I don't give a fuck. I go out. As I'm going out, John Fitzpatrick grabs my streaming phone, rips it off me. He says, "I'm taking this," and Country pushes me out of the door. Country stands there. <coughs> he's a big guy and blocks the whole door. Every time I try to reach to grab my phone, give me my phone, he pushes me back over and over again. Eventually with like, the cops have seen this because the cops told me I saw you getting kicked out and saw the whole thing go down. Probably two minutes after of this going backwards and forwards, I finally get my phone. I'm like, fuck this, I'm out of here. I don't want to deal with this fucking swatting. I don't want to fucking deal with uh, this drama. I don't want to deal with this manager being an, like an unnecessary asshole to me. Mm -hmm. So I start walking down the hill. As I'm walking down the hill, this other guy comes up to Fuck. me, and he I, I don't know his get name. Get to the get to the no like, no no. It's all relevant. What's this going on for? Like what, no, what, it's all relevant. It's all relevant. This other guy comes up to me, and he starts asking me why yeah, you why are you here, why are you here, what are you doing here. Um, and I'm like, I'm invited, and he's like, how? Who invited you? I'm like, Fuzi said I could come. I spoke to his assistant, girlfriend, whatever. I show him the DMs, and he says, fine. In Adam's 22's vlog, which I later see at a later date, which is relevant to what I'm going to tell you, Country is in the background talking to the police, right behind me, right? He's talking to the police. The moment I start walking off, I'm walking down, Country comes running down. You're not going anywhere. You're not going anywhere. And the police have said we're free to leave if we want to. You're not going anywhere, and he's pushing me. And on, um, what them, you know them black kids' names who are with you, right next to you vlogging at the same time? I have a footage I can show you later. DDG in them? Yeah, I don't know. They're, they're pushing me, uh, they have video of country pushing me, grabbing my arm, not letting me leave. And I'm like, why are you detaining me? Like, what if I, like you, you don't have the right to do that, first of all. And I haven't done anything wrong, just let me go. <clears throat> and he won't let me go. He keeps pushing me, he keeps telling me, he keeps telling me. This goes on for t enough for everyone of the influencers to see it's going on. Um, then he starts shouting, officer, officer, officer. These two officers run over to me, instantly handcuff me, search me and put me in the back of a police car for three hours. Mm -hmm. While I'm sitting in the back of the police car, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I was, whilst I'm sitting in the back of the police car, they left me alone. <laughs> you cracked me up, dude. You're in good spirit. I like I'm you. Just, You're just I'm just chilling. I'm just chilling, dude. I'm just. We're, I'm here to. Let's just hear out the story, guys. Okay, okay, Come on. Okay. Because it's going to go on for fucking ever, otherwise. Whilst I'm sitting in the back of. Fuzzy, you want to listen to this because you're going to have to address this. This is your oh, team we're talking about. Oh, okay. Whilst I'm sitting in the back of the police car, right in front of me is the whole police report. Four pipe bombs have been laid underneath the crowd. They're going to be detonated, and the police told me that they said they wanted $5,000. Suspect. Guy wearing a black T-shirt, shaved head with his nose pierced, okay? Not me. It, you were wearing a black T-shirt yesterday. You have your nose pierced. You have a shaved head. That's who... That's who that, I'm, not saying, I'm not saying you did it, but I'm saying the person that called... Oh no, I'm not saying you did it. The person yeah, who called it in okay. was trying to frame you yeah, as, the, as, of humor, as, yeah. the, as the suspect, right? <laughs> Um, so I'm sitting there thinking, then why am I sitting here? Like, why am I sitting in the back of this cop car if I'm not a suspect, right? They never called in my name. They never called in my details. It turns out after three hours of me sitting there and I've worked these details out and I asked the cops, they say, you know the people that chucked you out? One of the teams, so I don't know whether it's country and I don't know whether it's John Fitz. I can't confirm this. Mm -hmm. One of them two told the police I was shouting that I had a bomb. Mm-hmm. 
I'm just chilling with Adam, huh? Yeah, I'm just chilling with Adam, huh? I'm just chilling with Adam, huh? Look, that's the host of Adam, huh? I'm just chilling with Adam. <laughs>